Hi, welcome to Software Basics. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to resolve this rendering error that you get with Sony Vegas. <laughs> So in this video I'm using Sony Vegas Pro 15. This should work on previous version, but obviously for it to be exact, it has to be Vegas 15 as well. So basically what happens is whenever you go to render a project, this dialog box does not pop up and you usually get this message coming up instead. Now to resolve this, all we have to simply do is reset Sony Vegas, including clearing the cache data, the first thing I would recommend you do is back up your favorite settings for rendering. So basically, if we go to render and we filter show favorites only, you can see I have all my favorites for rendering. Now, this isn't going to delete your plugin presets or your effects presets or even your render settings. It's just going to delete how your favorites are displayed. That's all. So when you come back, this isn't going to be here anymore. It's only a little bit of an inconvenience, but this is how you resolve it. You just simply go to this location. Now for you, you can just simply write this exact code into your file explorer. So we'll change my username to percent username percent. So you can just simply copy this. I will have it in the description and you just simply paste it in and press enter. It will bring you to the same location. That way you don't have to go activating your hidden files and folders and all that stuff. So once we get this, I'm just going to copy it to the desktop and we've basically made a backup of that. As you can see, the time here is 4.51 and now we can go to Sony Vegas, close it and then we'll hold control and shift and then we need to open Sony Vegas again. Make sure you keep holding control and shift until this dialog box shows up. Then you just simply check delete all cached application data and hit yes. So Sony Vegas is gonna restart again. This may take a little bit longer than usual. So Sony Vegas has now reset it itself and your cache data has been cleared off. So I'm gonna check do not show then I'll go to media generator and then I'll drag this over to my timeline. Now if I go to render and if I go to show favorites, you can see my favorites aren't there. Now if I go to this folder, you can see it still says the time of the original favorites file. It hasn't deleted it yet. However, if we drag the new one onto it, it's not going to show. So what we want to do is make sure we go cancel. We go back to this you can see it has a new time for 451 and then we just simply go to the desktop and bring the backup so i'm going to move and replace you can see the time has now changed back to 451 and if i go to sony vegas again hit render show favorites you can see all my favorites are still there so that's pretty much how you resolve this whole issue if that didn't work for you there is another option that you can try you can try rendering as a batch project. So if we go to tools, then we go to scripting and then batch render. You should have an option here to render in a batch. So you can just say render region, render the whole project and so on. If that still doesn't work for you, you can try file, real time render and then render as a WAV file. Obviously, this is the most limiting option because you can only render as WAV. So I hope this helps you resolve the issue. If you have any questions at all, please make sure you leave it in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more videos like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.